what is going on you guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new and you've never seen my face before hi my name is ash and this is my channel living ash today is thursday happy whatever day of the week it is to you tomorrow's friday my favorite day of the week seriously so i've been in the mood for fall right and i'm in south florida and if you're worrying about the hurricane and everything we did not really get any effects from it really like just some thunderstorms and stuff um but it's sunny out right now beautiful day honestly i've just been in the fall festive mood and i think it's due to the candles that i had from like the last few semi-annual sales at bath and body works that have really kind of put me in this place and i'm going to show you the two that i've used up in the past like week or i would say they finished the past week but i kind of use them up throughout the month of august and whenever i would just smell them like i just have to show you they were so good now if you saw my last video i actually showed them towards the end these are the little single wick candles from bath and body works this is fresh balsam and then this is autumn i have realized that i do thoroughly enjoy fall candles smelling them and one they project so well throughout my home and these are just the single wicks. I can imagine today when we go to the store, me picking up a three wick candle and how that's gonna smell in my apartment. Like it's just me in here. And I mean, something has made me feel like, I don't know. I mean, I'm a summer girl. Let me tell you that right now. I'm definitely a summer girly, but I feel a sense of security, hominess, and warmth when i think of fall christmas and thanksgiving new year's all that all this like winter folly like stuff so i'm gonna just go get the candles today and i wanted to take you guys along with me if you're new here let me know in the comments down below i would love to welcome you to the channel and if you're an og supporter you're always here my family thank you so much for spending time with me i always love to think about how you guys could be anywhere in the world on any channel but you chose to be right here with me and i am so so grateful for that okay so first things first scent of the day i woke up i put on makeup today for the past week i have not worn makeup and i kind of like oh my gosh i'm loving it like i love the face i love the look i keep looking at myself I can't stop looking at myself true <laughs> but i'm editing the video like my edge control I don't know what it is like sometimes when I put on makeup and I do my edge control like it like turns white and it flakes like that is one of the things I hate about edge control but like don't mind that in the beginning or wherever else you see it okay we're trying to get it together so it's just been nice to like have makeup on again but I'm also worried about my skin because I've been just really trying to like clear my skin and make sure that you know one, I want to be comfortable with my own face and not always feel like, oh, I'm not put together if I don't have makeup on uh, because I don't need it, right? Like, I don't want to ever feel like I need this to function in my daily life. No, like, I like this. It enhances my features, but it isn't something that I would say is a necessity. And I don't want anyone around me, my friends, my family to be like, oh my God, where's your makeup? Like, because they're not used to my face. Because my face is my face. It's not changing, okay? That's my little makeup rant, but I'm happy. I love my makeup today. Um, if you wanna know my lip, I'm wearing this Dior lip product here. I actually got this like on a whim. I don't know when I purchased this and I totally forgot I had it. This is so nice. This is probably around the time when the Dior lip oil came out and I actually ended up purchasing this. It's in the color 721 Glitz. It's called the Stellar Gloss. I really like it. I mean, I've just been kind of playing with it all day. I love it so much um, and it's a really, really pretty color. I decided to actually bring out one of the OGs. I love Burberry fragrances. I think Burberry lingers on the skin really well and it does, I personally get a lot of compliments from it. So this is the Burberry Body EDP. I found this in my closet. And I was like, you know what, let me just wear it. Like it kind of gives me like a powdery scent. If I have the notes, I'll pop them up on the screen. If I'm right, I might be right, I don't know. But I did want to wear this. I brought out the new After Hours from Sol de Janeiro. I love this, I really do. I think this is really, really nice. It's good, y'all. I, I, yo, they need the body cream for this. I'm going to say it out loud because I know someone from Sol de Janeiro is watching. Please bring this out in the body cream. I will buy it in a heartbeat. Please. This after hour spray is so good. It has jasmine, amber woods, uh, black currant. I did get a comment about it being similar to Into the Night from Bath and Body Works. 
I am not feeling that. I don't get that vibe from this at all. No, it's not giving me into the night personally, but this is so good. You need to get it now. I don't know how long they're gonna have this in store, but if you love a good perfumey, it's a strong scent in my opinion. You're gonna want this one. And for my body cream. And don't forget, comment down below and let me know what you are wearing. I read the comments and I like to see what you guys have on. You guys put me on to all different types of combos. You obviously see how much I mix up my products. So I'm always interested in knowing what you guys have going on. I actually am wearing this Laura Mercier Ombre Vanille. So this one I actually decided to wear because I love Laura Mercier and I've been talking about that for years on my channel. But I just like this body cream. It's not nearly as strong as the original body cream. I will tell you that right now. Their formula change is crazy. Now the scent is pretty spot on, but the longevity is just not there anymore. But I like it. I mean, I'm pretty moisturized. My skin looks really nice, and that's my body cream for the day. So again, make sure you guys comment down below and let me know what you guys had on today because I would love to know. I have my coupons here. Funny thing, actually, since we're here, let's just see if any of them are expired. You see, this is why I read before I go. So I have this one. Um, this one was from probably like last month which is such a freaking waste. Like, I just don't go to Bath & Body Works as much as I did before. It's just a lot, y'all. There's just so much going on. This is expired and has expired on the 27th, and it's the 31st, I think. <laughs> so now, luckily for me, I picked this up the other day at the mailbox, and this one, oh my gosh. Okay, so this one is actually good through October 1st, so we are good. I have a $7 moisturizing Body wash, 25% off the candles, and then free hand sanitizer. So we're gonna go get some fall candles, come back, do like an OG original video, and just kind of like talk about the scents and chill for a little bit. So let's head out to the store. It's about four o'clock now, and let's see what we can find. It is beyond hot in Florida still, like, and it's probably gonna be like this forever. Like I know that there are like heat waves everywhere right now. Um, and every day we have some sort of like heat advisory. It's so hot, like I have to sit in the car and like wait until it cools down because my, my car is a push to start and the button to push, I've burnt my finger on that button because it is so hot. Ridiculous, you guys. I genuinely am like, okay, when is it not gonna be this hot? Like, it's really bad. But I don't know. I've, I was telling my cousin too that I, <laughs> the, the only thing I don't like about Florida, which I love Florida, like I genuinely do, but I don't know how long I'm, I'm gonna be living in Florida, but I'll say this, like I love dressing up for fall, like for the seasons. If I put on long sleeve or put on boots when it is fall, I look crazy. They can be like, what are you doing? Because is hot like there's no reason so it's like really hard to like dress up for the seasons but we're gonna figure it out we're gonna figure it out i gotta turn the ac up a little bit so i know you guys are gonna hear it but i'll talk again once the car cools down because y'all is so all right you guys so we just made it but i have to carry the umbrella which i don't want to do but it's supposed to rain like the weather says that it's supposed to rain within the next like 10 to 15 minutes so i gotta carry all this stuff in my hand Ooh, we got fall candles right at the entrance it literally smells like fall in here Ooh, praline delight marshmallow fireside this smells really good and it's pretty too Look at the packaging on this one, you guys. Blueberry maple pancakes. Love that. Mmm, but I don't love the scent that much. These kind of look like the old school candles. Like, ooh, autumn chai smells good. I might get this one, you guys. I like that. I don't even like chai tea, though, which is crazy. But, ooh, pumpkin apple. So they're all on sale. They're only $14.95. Not bad. Mm -hmm. And if you have a coupon, you can use that with it yeah, as well. <laughs> That's good. Yeah. And also our little um, pocket bag sanitizers are only a dollar. 
Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, not yeah. bad. Okay. Thank so, you. Here, no problem. If you have any questions, my name is Jennifer. Oh, apricot and green fig. Hmm. Walk in the woods. Oh, this smells good too. What the heck? Check out the banner here. Wonderful. That is so cute. The new body here. Moonlight Martini. They have this Copper Fields Sweet Whiskey, which was like so popular before. And what is this, y'all? What is this? If y'all know what this is, let me know because I have no clue what this is. Oh, it's a perfume or a room spray? I think it's a perfume, but I could be wrong. I need to smell it though. I'm gonna smell it. Mm, this is good. Yeah. Oh my gosh. This smells so good. I need a body care sale for this. They have some 50% off items right here. Spiced cardamom. We have rose and lychee, local paradise body lotions. Oh, they have the gingham fresh and some candles, fifty percent off, which isn't bad. And oh, this is fifty percent off. I'm gonna get this, y'all. What the heck? I'm gonna get both of these. Okay, this is so cute. It's the what is this? Wild sand. I need to get a little basket, so I'm kind of. Oh, they're right there. One of my favorite candles is Mahogany Takewood. Smells so good, but again, I gotta remember what I came for, and that is the fall goodness. Cute packaging for this right here. Smoked caramel mezcal. I don't really like mezcal though. Which one is this? Prickly pear sangria. Ooh, are you kidding? This smells so good. Oh nah, this one's amazing. Check out these new vanilla perfumes. Let me see. Which one is this? Oh, th this has to be white pumpkin. Yep, that's good too. Uh, pumpkin pecan waffles. Mmm, that's good. Oh my gosh. Mountain teak wood. No. Mm. Champagne, apple, and honey. Oh, that's good too. Oh my gosh. Leaves. Mmm. I love leaves. It smells like cinnamon. Nope. Oh, there's the clove. These aren't fall. So I'm not going to even look at these. I might need to come back over here. Mmm. Mm. Okay, I'm going to just go back to like the end of the store to kind of see what else they have because... I feel like the fall ones at the front are nice, but I want to make sure that I'm seeing everything that I could see because these fall candles are making me feel so good right now. Okay, we have a whole section here and I love the packaging for these candles. Those are cute. <gasps> Look at this, you guys. Harvest pomegranate. Mm, let's check it out. Mm, it smells good, but I don't love it. Like, I want to love everything that I pick up today. Oh yeah, I said I was gonna pick up an autumn chai, so let me smell it. Mm, wait, hold on, it's not as strong as I thought. I just like the packaging. I think that's what I'm falling for right now. Apricot and green fig. That's okay, but I don't love that either. Ooh, look at this one, guys. Apple macchiato. Look at that. Fresh fall morning is good. It's pretty fresh. I might like that. I'm gonna put it in that part. Okay, let's smell apple macchiato. It's pretty good, but no. Autumn woods. This is good, but I don't like the color. I want it to be like brown or like a neutral. That smells pretty good too. I probably should get this. Which is this? Pumpkin spice latte. No, no, no. That's too coffee. Oh my god. I feel like I'm not finding stuff that I love. Do you love shopping at Bath and Body Works? I'm definitely thinking my limits on candles is about five of them. Um, I don't really need that many. I already have some candles in the house, so I think I found the perfect fall candle you guys it smells so good this right here chef's kiss literally okay so let's consolidate i'm trying to see if i really love these oh that's good oh my gosh 
Oh, that's perfect. That's giving me the vibe. That's different. I like that one. That one's like a lychee martini. I don't know. I gotta go through it and see. I'll see you guys when I get out of here because this is a lot. going on you guys it's the next day and i got the goods okay and i came home yesterday because i ended up going to bath and body works and then i ended up going to like different stores and that is one of my biggest issues i am practicing just going for what i came for but it's, it is not easy and i know a lot of you can probably relate to that um if you're like a shopaholic you know so here we are i was very good i was able to give myself a i wouldn't even say budget because i wasn't really on the budget i was like you only need five i wanted to go with five that's my lucky number so i want to show you guys the ones that i got and i don't know i'm just picking them up at random i had a little bit of a hard time picking between this one actually this is called fall farmhouse and this has spice pine fall air spiced pumpkin forest pine branch it's like so pretty so there's another one called fresh fall morning or something like that which honestly maybe now i can see why i maybe had some sort of like oh like i don't know like i just couldn't decide i was so undecisive so this has fresh fall air as one of the notes so maybe because they are somewhat similar now i will say they just they don't smell exactly the same i guess they just have similar notes that's kind of probably why i was split between the two but this one smells so good so i gave myself this rule right i had to smell the candle and make sure that it actually gave me this fall feeling if you know if this is one of those if you know you know there's a feeling that you get when you think about fall and christmas and the holidays i think that i felt it most when i was a kid and as an adult you kind of have to try to keep it alive for yourself you know when you believe in like all these things like santa and all these things it's like a magical feeling that kind of goes away when you get older so doing things like this like buying the fall candles putting them in my home and just burning them and smelling them it's my way of keeping that little piece of magic alive okay so i got this fall farmhouse if you go ahead and check out the packaging this candle is very aesthetically pleasing in my opinion i was looking for that with the candles as well i was kind of trying to stay around the realm of like what colors my home entails you know i wanted to make sure that i could actually like the candle inside and out this one is just really pretty and it definitely gave me that fall feeling and the pine notes are everything to me i am a real christmas tree girl i know the fake trees are nice um you know you can keep them all year round whatever use them again but that real christmas tree pine scent there is nothing that tops that okay so for the next candle because y'all know i can go on and on this is called leaves this one i saw and i said okay i'm getting this one because it did have uh, another version with the different packaging and again i really did focus on the packaging and like loving the packaging that i picked up leaves is oh my gosh for some reason i get cinnamon or maybe it's that red apple that i'm smelling crisp red apple golden nectar warm clove spice you guys if you don't go get your fall candles after this video i don't know what you're gonna do with it it's fall now to me i don't care <laughs> i'm so excited and it smells so good <laughs> oh, you guys i'm so happy see this is the feeling like i'm genuinely feeling like joy inside smelling this candle so that means it's a good candle so leaves is cute this packaging is really nice as well i can kind of put it in any room in my house i think it has like a little bit of like wax on the side uh beautiful beautiful and these were all $14.95 and I used a coupon so I can't remember. I don't know if I have my receipt here but I did get money off which is great. Next candle. Alright, this right here. If you haven't yet, I'm gonna have a TikTok go up today along with this video. It's gonna say like wake up. It's the first of the month, right? Because today is September 1st. Wake up. It's the first of the month. 
um, and I used this candle in the video and this is called the perfect autumn now again I live in South Florida I don't really experience fall like most people in other states but this is my way of kind of just getting in the vibe and this one is so pretty like it reminds me of like just being in my mom's home and like one my mom's house always smells good shout out to my mama she watches all my videos her house smells good all the time okay and when it's fall like she'd have all these like candles and these fall festive things around and it just reminds me of like growing up so oh this one's good so this has fresh cranberry and you guys know that i'm on a fat loss journey and it's more like a health thing and just staying consistent and all these things and i love sweet treats i love cakes i love salty food i love all that but right now because i'm ready to get to my goal this time and not fall off like i've done so many times over and over um i'm hoping that by like the fall I can start incorporating you know my sweet treats back into my lifestyle because I think that kind of makes fall fun is having like these really special cookies and the sweet potato pies and all these really really good yummy foods so I'm just excited for that but anyways the perfect autumn um, again a fresh cranberry spice pumpkin crisp apple rich clove that clove i don't like clove you know when you it's like thanksgiving and you eat like i don't know if it's rice and peas or like something they put clove in something i personally haven't cooked with clove in my meals but when you bite into that clove the worst but oh my gosh this one is super super good and the packaging is so on point for a fall festive candle I absolutely adore it it's beautiful it's simple and it's nice now I want to know please let me know what are your favorite movies that you only watch around the fall season I want to start maybe a challenge for myself because I've been having a hard time finding a balance uh, work-life balance right now where I kind of work all day every day and then by 9 10 o'clock it's time to go to bed you know and I try to read at night but I do want to wind down and kind of just not focus on work and like watch a movie or something or a show I know the ultimatum back on Netflix so I'm gonna watch that but I kind of want to get into the holiday spirit ah! okay so we have another goodie this one's cute Sundays for me were always not my favorite day I'll say this because I always felt like I had to stay home on Sunday I had to clean I had to get ready for school the next day uh, and now as an adult I completely understand why it's so important to rest and prepare for the week ahead on a Sunday and this candle is so fitting it's called cozy Sunday morning and I am so excited because Sundays have also become my favorite day of the week besides Friday which is today Sundays are when the love of my life gets to call uh, home and he always calls me and we're able to talk for like honestly it's such a blessing like sometimes up to like 45 minutes on the phone and we kind of just get to hear each other's voice so sunday is like my favorite day of the week and it's just one of the days i look forward to so cozy sunday night i hope i said that before i feel like i said cozy sunday morning or something <laughs> i think it's cozy sunday night guys and it has warm cinnamon uh crystallized ginger and vanilla bean oh my gosh it was really hard for me to only get five of these you guys it was extremely incredibly hard but this one i love the packaging too i don't like when the packaging is crazy like i think this one is super simple elegant to the point gorgeous got faith in you and i i think i might end up going back for more maybe next month like maybe i'll just do like a couple candles a month because we have such a long holiday season ahead so okay maybe that'll be my little incentive so this right here i don't know i said i was strictly going for fall but i also was going for that feeling and this candle gave me a feeling and now i don't know no i do know it wasn't the fall feeling but it was like that friday night stepping out i worked hard i made my money this week i'm gonna have some fun get some drinks type of vibe this is what this candle gave me and it's called prickly pear sangria and i'm not really a sangria girl i'm a lychee martini type of girl i'm a moscato type of girl i love wine i am like a wine enthusiast and 
This reminds me of a wine that I get at Cooper's Hawk, which is a winery here in my city. And they have it in other cities too, I'm sure. If you've never been to Cooper's Hawk, it is so nice. You get to sample wine and it's only about 10 to $15. You get eight glasses of wine and you get to try blueberry wine, chocolate wine, uh, expensive wine as well over like $50 a bottle. Like they are so cool and this kind of gives me that like Cooper's Hawk vibe and it's so pretty. I have to get one for my mom. Like I know for a fact that she would love this. She is so different than me. She likes very fruity. Uh, our Island Margarita is one of her favorite ones. I feel like she would just absolutely love this candle. And the notes on this are prickly pear syrup. It's so sweet. It's so syrupy. It has white wine, freshly sliced fruit infusions. This one is just good now one of the things that i feel about this candle is like i don't want to put it out yet like i don't want to use it because i know it's that good i love this i've never really read the warning on these like it says to keep away from children and pets like that's a given but it says always trim wicks one to four inches before each relighting which is so good sometimes i'm lazy and i don't want to trim my wicks but um Keep wax pool free of wick trimmings and matches. Do not burn candle for more than four hours. And do not extinguish with water. <laughs> That's a good tip. But this one's really, really good, you guys. Did I show you guys close up, like, the packaging, how pretty it is? I am absolutely obsessed. Now, I don't love the packaging. I think it could have been better. I feel like a little, like, I don't know, like, a, maybe a martini glass or some sort of, like, that would have got me. Um, but I love their, like, wine cellar candle and some of their like wine candles i don't know what the obsession is but it's there that's it for the candles i just want to add that i was able to pick up this antibacterial hand spray this is the wild sand i got this for free with one of the coupons that i got you could either get this or a regular like pocket back but i love this one so they did have that wild sand candle available but i ended up not getting it because i was like where's the feeling at right like I didn't get that with that candle so I put it back and right here so like I said I went to different places not just Bath and Body Works and I and this is another lesson that I just continue to learn over and over like I guess I just I haven't fully grasped it yet so I keep experiencing moments like this where I will search for something and I will be honest I wasn't searching for this as heavily but I did make an effort to stop every time I went to a TJ Maxx store and look for this I've been seeing it all over I'm in several Facebook groups I'm also on TikTok so I see all the like trendy things and this is called the Mimic Fragrance Laboratories it's a compound 32 uh, these fragrances are allegedly supposedly dupes for some of our favorite most popular fragrances I believe they have like Tom Ford, Rose um, Prick, or is it Lost Cherry? It's one of the ones like that. And then they also have this one, which everyone wanted this one because it's actually a dupe for the Sol de Janeiro uh, 62, which is so pretty. This has, I don't even know if it has notes, but it has an oil concentration of 20%. It's an EDP, a warm blend of gourmands. When I smelled it though, you guys, it does smell great on me. Like, and it smells just like the Sol de Janeiro. It's $20 though, which I don't feel is that much of a difference from the actual Sol de Janeiro. Like it's expensive. I wonder if this is like priced a little bit higher than it was when it was originally released. I don't know. But this I found not even looking. I just happened to see it yesterday right at the checkout line. And I was actually very impressed. I was like, wow, like this was easy. And I've been searching you guys. I promise you I've been searching and trying to find and I just wasn't able to find it. So when I wasn't looking, I found it. And I guess the same thing applies to love, right? <laughs> Quickly, another candle. And I'm actually not sure if I'm gonna keep it at this point because I'm thinking about the price and I'm like, is this worth the money, right? But it was so cute and I collect candles like these. This is a candle which I think is perfect for fall. Are you kidding me? Like, you would think that I'm drinking some sort of like cappuccino hot chocolate and it is absolutely gorgeous. Check it out, you guys. This was $13 at TJ Maxx. Kind of pricey, but I mean, the artistry, the craft, it's 
gorgeous look at that it's so nice and i do believe in paying for things like this because they take time to make this is a dessert candle you guys and it is so cool so if you ever see any of these in your local tj maxx or marshall's too you can actually find these i say pick it up if the price isn't too crazy and i'm gonna link these down below i'm gonna put this on the side or if i did a sideways video i'll just put it here in the video target has these amazing workout sets that are absolutely gorgeous and they are so flattering now they are pricey but the set that i have on today is kind of similar to the red one that i'm going to showcase here in this video but i actually paid like 90 dollars for this set at aritzia and aritzia quality is 10 out of 10 but the price is like not so right to me so i just have to say i'm gonna link these down below i will also make a tiktok so you can check it on my tiktok but this is one of like the um what is this like a jumpsuit kind of like or i, mean, I want to know what they call this it's a bodysuit and it is so pretty and this was $40 so it's way less than you would pay at like Aritzia or another store maybe Zara um, and Target I'm telling you has such cute ones I'll even post the ones that I didn't purchase that I was still contemplating getting so this is a bottom I love athleisure I am always home I work from home so I'm not always like out right so but i do want to look somewhat put together in my home so having outfits like this that i can just wear and kind of look done up but also not too dressy it's one of those things that i'm always gonna get and this is the top now i do feel this top is so so flattering it is so cute i love the way that it's made and this was only 24 this needs to be removed oh my gosh i did self checkout for this you guys i'm probably gonna have to go back to target and have them take it off because i don't know how i'm gonna take this off yeah this was a really really good buy i'm gonna literally have to go back to target oh my gosh when you do self checkout i'm so confused i'm really really confused right now you guys because this one doesn't have it on there that is it for today's video thank you so much for spending time with me here today and just indulging in my obsession with scents and things and i am so excited for the first of the month this is a brand new month the slate has been wiped clean you have to set your goals this month like sit down after this video make some goals write them down and don't set them to say like I need to get this done by September 30th or whatever. No, I'm just telling you to set some goals this month. I lost a total of 12 pounds, 12 pounds in a month with just eating healthier less processed foods i went to the gym more times last month than i've probably gone in my entire life i've really used my time that i have now while i'm like literally so alone because my man is gone um to just kind of focus on my goals and things that i know are going to make me better and i hope that you guys will do that for yourselves it's the best decision you'll ever make just eating healthier investing in yourself focusing on you and coming up with a routine and staying discipline and consistent use this month to change your life for the better you can do it start today don't wait until it's monday don't wait till monday it's september 1st it's a friday use this weekend to just take time for yourself and to plan and to become the best version of you this month is going to be great i'm sending you love blessings opportunity god is with you he loves you you are covered and i pray that all of you guys are going to have a great weekend and a beautiful beautiful month and rest of the year thank you guys so much for watching i will see you guys in the next video make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you are new follow me on instagram at ash220 underscore and tiktok at livingash20 make sure you give the video a thumbs up come back for the next one i will be here for you guys and i'll see you soon bye guys